back here at this year's supercomputing show in New Orleans. Ron Minnick is a computer scientist for Sandia, and he conducted a series of demonstrations on a project known as Megatux that's designed to fight malicious botnets. We're doing a project called Megatux, and we're trying to boot a million virtual machines on big, high-end supercomputers. A virtual machine basically allows you to take a single machine and run a thousand operating systems on it. It's like it's a thousand machines, but they're not real, they're virtual. This has 200 ARM CPUs in it. Each ARM CPU can run 10 virtual machines, so this can act like 2,000 machines. Probably one of the hottest topics in, in cybersecurity today is how to manage the problem of botnets. They come in and they attack networks, they take over networks, they're hard to detect, they're hard to counter, they're hard to understand. Botnets don't actually work correctly unless they have at least 100,000 or more nodes they've taken over. We can't easily get 100,000 or a million nodes, so instead we run a million virtual machines, then we can run the botnet on those million virtual machines. But again, even to run a million virtual machines, you need a fairly big machine to do it. So we wanted to have a smaller machine, which is this machine, so that we could run at a smaller scale and essentially give our software a dry run, so to speak, before we go and commit to running on a big machine, because that's very expensive. This kind of work is aimed at improving our understanding of how a botnet acts over a network. If we can essentially cultivate a botnet on a system like this and observe its behavior, that will allow us to learn more about what we see when we see a botnet acting on a network.